Is it only me? You know, we have a crackdown on large Thanksgiving gatherings, so we're out in the store. You can't find a turkey under 95 pounds. 95 pounds. I mean, pounds. what is it? Why can't you find a 12 pound or an 8 pound turkey? Well, 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 they turkey. Well, turkeys didn't know about the COVID that was coming oh, up, okay, the pandemic. Okay. WMER 2 News Jeff Hager has more on how people are gobbling up birds from a turkey farm in Howard County. Shona Farm here in Fulton has enough turkeys to go around, but the pandemic has changed the dynamic of what people are looking for. Ah, the pursuit of a fresh turkey. We drove out in our motor home. It's just the last leg of their 2300 mile journey. And we all quarantined for 14 days before. As David and Barbara Mail of Phoenix, Arizona, reunite with their granddaughter, Rachel. We wanted to be together for the holidays, but we wanted to do it safely. It is that kind of determination that's driving robust turkey sales here at Shona Farm in Fulton. Thank you. <laughs> where people are on a pace to purchase almost 20,000 turkeys for Thanksgiving. We've all been pretty well sequestered since March. Easter, we kind of let that go. Fourth of July, you didn't see the big gatherings. Labor Day, maybe there was some outside gatherings, but this is really the first holiday where people can get together as a family, and it's a huge tradition for most families. Made a little less big by calls from state and local leaders to cut back on the size of this year's gatherings to help slow the surge in COVID-19. Demand is still high this year, but it's changed a bit, as have plans for traditional gatherings. The biggest change we've seen is that there are people getting smaller turkeys and instead of a family maybe coming and getting one large turkey, we'll have several of the same family members coming to get smaller turkeys. And for people still looking for that last minute bird, walk-ins are welcome here. They'll be open on Wednesday from 7 to 5, but they will be closed on Thanksgiving Day. Reporting in Howard County, Jeff Hager, WMAR 2 News.